dog with a plastic jug stuck on its head finally captured after more than a month on the run in Bay Manette. It's a positive ending to a bizarre story that began in October. That's when residents first spotted the dog and called police after seeing it was struggling for help. As WKRG News 5's Blake Brown explains, the dog, now nicknamed Jughead, will soon be ready for his new home. On the run for five weeks with a jug on its head, braving cold temperatures, scared of anyone trying to help. His body conditions kind of showed that he was trying to eat, find food, water. The jug made it tough, but he somehow managed to rub a hole in the bottom of the plastic container for air. Animal Control Officer Ashlyn Hale believes that hole also helped him get needed food and water on the streets. She says concerned residents near Brady Road and Bay Manette started calling police in October when they first spotted the dog, providing tips on where to look. I'm just hoping that we, we can get to him in time before something happens. Uh, can't see where he's going. Hopefully he didn't run out in the middle of the road. Last week, Hill set a trap in the area, and to her surprise, it worked. He's on antibiotics now and has some healing to do, but overall, the dog, nicknamed Jughead, is in good shape considering what he's encountered over the last month. He does have a couple wounds on his ankles. Um, on his feet where they're just swollen from there's no telling he couldn't see where he was running so um, he made a might have ran through a fence caught his leg anything like that after five weeks on the run he's ready for a home the dog is expected to go up for adoption in two weeks he's walking better but still skittish I'm just trying to get him used to people more Hale says no one has claimed the dog so now it's her mission to make sure he goes to a good home in Baymanette, I'm Blake Brown, WKRG News 5.